And we're live. Hey, everybody. I am shooting this video to show you how to uh, get your WordPress uh, website to load where you can fix it uh, when a plugin is giving you one of those fatal errors. So uh, let's, let's take a look at the screen. I got a, a text from a buddy of mine today that one of my websites was down. Of course, my first thought was, what is he even going to the site for? I have no idea what content's up there anymore. Um, but uh, but when we try to go to Phineas.com today, then we see fatal error. An array, uh, arrays are not allowed in class con uh, constants and blah, 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 blah. Um, line 31. So the important stuff here is if you if your website is broken, uh, then your your path will be different. But what we want to look at here is the WP Content Plugins Jetpack, right? Uh, this is this is showing this is how we determine which plugin. So we know it's a plugin issue because it's in the in the plugins folder. It's code within a plugin, and in this case, it's inside Jetpack, which is by Automatic, which is Matt Mullenweg. So uh, a little surprised to see that Jetpack plugin is, is breaking my site, but um, that's, that's the case. So now that you've identified it's a plugin that's breaking your site and the plugin that is breaking it is this one here. And, and you can do this for any plugin. It doesn't have to be Jetpack. It just happens to be Jetpack in this scenario, in this case. Um, you'll want to go into your file manager uh, and depending on your hosting, how you get there will differ. So I'm not going to do all that. Um, just you can figure out how to get to your file manager for your hosting or ping me. Uh, but you should you should be able to Google whoever your, your hosting provider is and file manager and, and, and get there. Once you get to your uh, to your file manager, this is showing you the path, right? Um, in this case, it's my domain name slash WP content slash plugin slash jetpack. And so if we look in the folder structure, website, WP content, plugins, and here is the culprit right here. This is the quick fix. Rename this folder. We'll just put hyphen one. We're going to rename that folder. So what that does, this, <clears throat> because I renamed it, the, whatever code that was breaking this is no longer there. I pretty much, this is how you deactivate this plugin, right? So now that I have renamed this, there is no longer a folder here named Jetpack. Um, so let's try the site now. Hit refresh. Ta-da! So now I can actually log in to my WP admin. Uh, oh, I guess I should have shown you that. When, when, when there's a break, all right, now that we rename the, the folder, if we try to go to this site, we're going to hit an error again. And in this case, WP admin. In this case, we can't get into our admin. Sometimes you can get into your admin. It just kind of depends on where the code is firing or not firing. So we rename that folder, hit refresh. There you go. Okay. So that is how you that's how you access your WP admin when a plugin is giving your website a fatal error. Talk to you next time. If you need any help with your, your WordPress stuff, you can ping me on Twitter, Phineas, uh, or head to dropthestrap.com and, and use any of that um, contact, uh, any of those channels to contact me. All right.